I was 19 when my brother William was killed. It was April of 1992, about two weeks before the Rodney King riots and well before social media and cell phone cameras. My family was left to grapple with his death in the community where I grew up on Long Island, which is where the title comes from. Strong Island is slang for Long Island, New York. I had a lot of rules growing into Strong Island. When I think about it, they were designed to protect me in a way. I think that those rules were an unconscious admission that I was entering into a process that I did not know um, the trajectory of and that I could not predict. And so I made myself a list of 10 rules to try to hedge against that unpredictability by dropping those rules and allowing myself to be honest um, and vulnerable in ways that, you know, are not necessarily comfortable at all times, that I actually was doing honor to my mother's courage. I was meeting her in her willingness to talk from the place of her deepest pain with absolute clarity. And, as an artist, it's my obligation to bring to you, the audience, the way in which you can best relate to my character in the film, which is very, very, very close. Hi, I'm Yancey Ford. How was that? Even more smile is good. I mean, it's really nice. <laughs> Hi. I'm Yancey Ford, and my film, Strong Island, is premiering in the U.S. Documentary Competition at the 2017 Sundance Film Festival.